Okay, here I am again. I do apologize. I'm not sure. My computer just shut itself down. I've got the blue screen of death. <laughs> and it's making all sorts of whirring, clicking noises in the background. So I do apologize if the um, sound quality is a little bit poor. Um, but I've got my phone up and running. I have my fingers crossed that the phone won't cut out and that the people who were meditating with me find me again. So I'll just talk for a couple more minutes. I'm going to turn my air conditioner back on because it's getting quite hot and sticky here in Darwin. And I will give just a couple more minutes just in case um, the people who were meditating with me would like to join back in. And I do apologize again. I, Yeah, you know what? It's Mercury retrograde, I tell you what, me and technology at this time. Seriously. <laughs> so, here I, uh, here I am. I hope that this is... Ah, uh, Natalie, thank you. I'm so glad you found me. My apologies. I was just saying, I don't know, I think it's Mercury retrograde. My computer just shut itself down. Hi there. Thanks, Natalie, for joining me again. So, we will sink carefully back into our meditation yeah technology boy oh boy <laughs> anyway i'm glad you're here i'm glad that you're able to connect in again let's get straight back into it back into that beautiful sense of connection with self so just allowing your breath to draw you back in and these little distractions uh, the, the very thing that meditation trains us gives us the skill to be able to manage with ease and grace. So allowing yourself to draw a deep cleansing breath and letting it out with a sigh. Give yourself a little shake and then settle back into your meditation space with that sense of connection with the earth surrounded by your sphere of pure white light and connecting in with the Reiki energy and the angelic frequencies. Gently closing your eyes, coming back into your own space. Just allowing yourself to check in, connecting briefly with the ruby red root chakra. Sensing, seeing, feeling or imagining this ruby red chakra, clear and bright. This ruby orb that has been cleansed with your breath. has been reignited with your breath, spinning easily, and allowing your awareness to move gently upwards into your lower abdomen, into the space between your belly button and pubic bone. Connecting with the orange orb of your sacral chakra. Allowing your breath to connect with this orb. And noticing any darkness, any dust or dirt, cobwebs or indentations that may be obscuring this orb. And just allowing your breath to connect in the center here of this sphere of orange light. Noticing with each breath it grows brighter, clearer. It begins gently spinning. And as it spins, it loosens any of that dirt or dust, throws off the cobwebs and shadows, fills out any indentations, so it is a perfect sphere. 
and just noticing any cloud of dust or dirt that's been thrown off this beautiful orange chakra. Noticing any of this old, stuck, incorrect energy being picked up and returned to source for cleansing and transmutation. Leaving your sacral chakra clear, bright, spinning easily, vivid orange light and energy flowing through your body. And taking a deep cleansing breath, allowing your awareness to gently move upwards into your upper abdomen to the space between your belly button and sternum connecting here with a sphere of yellow light coming into connection with your solar plexus chakra I'm just noticing how this yellow orb looks to you. The quality of the colour. Any sense of darkness or shadow. Any dirt or cobwebs. Any indentations. And seeing, sensing, feeling or imagining your breath being drawn deep into the center of this orb of yellow light. And seeing that yellow light become brighter with each breath. And that your chakra, your solar plexus chakra, begins to shine a brilliant sunshine yellow as the sphere gently begins to spin, energized by your breath. Gently throwing off any dust, any cobwebs or shadows, smoothing out any indentations and noticing this cloud of debris detritus being picked up and returned to source for cleansing and transmutation leaving your solar plexus chakra spinning freely a vivid yellow light flooding through the upper abdomen region of your body clear and bright, brilliant sunshiny yellow. And just allowing your awareness now to be drawn gently to the center of your chest, to the green orb of light in the center of your chest, your beautiful heart chakra, And using your mind's eye, checking this sphere of light and allowing your breath to connect deep within your heart chakra so that your breath illuminates this orb of light, highlighting any darkness any shadow or indentations, any cobwebs ready to be cleared away. Noticing with each breath this deep emerald green glowing brighter and more brilliant as the sphere begins to gently spin. 
throwing off the shadows and the cobwebs, setting your heart energy free, clearing away the shadows, the doubts, smoothing out any dents or indentations so that your heart shines brilliant emerald green and the cloud of debris that's been cleansed away is picked up, moved out of your field, returned to source for cleansing and transformation, leaving you free and clear. The green orb of your heart chakra spinning gently, radiating emerald light throughout your chest, your upper arms, filling your body with emerald light. And allowing your awareness to be drawn gently upwards into your neck to be attracted to the sky blue orb of light that resides here in your neck your throat chakra allowing the breath to connect with this sky blue orb of light Just noticing the colour, noticing the density of the, the colour, allowing your breath to really be drawn into the centre of this orb, noticing that with each breath the colour becomes stronger, clearer, a vivid sky blue. And that any shadows, any dirt or dust, any cobwebs are gently moved out beyond the sphere. And that as the sphere begins to spin, this dirt and dust is gently thrown off. And that this cloud of dust is picked up and return to source for cleansing and transmutation. And this sphere spins gently, energized by your breath. Clear, bright, vivid sky blue. Just feeling the coolness that beautiful throat chakra energy moving through your throat, your shoulders and upper chest and up into your head. And then feeling that sky blue light washing through the whole of your body. And taking a deep cleansing breath allowing your awareness to move gently up into the head, into that space aligned with the eyebrows in the center of your forehead, connecting with the indigo orb of light, your third eye chakra. Sensing, seeing, feeling or imagining this orb of light receiving your breath. Imagining this indigo orb starting to glow, being revitalized by your breath. being illuminated from within 
showing up any shadows, any dirt or dust, any indentations or dents. Allowing your breath to connect with this beautiful sphere of indigo light. Noticing how it gently begins to spin. Clearing itself, shrugging off any dirt, cobwebs, any old stuck energy ready to be released. Noticing any dents smoothing out. As this orb spins freely, energized by your breath. And noticing this cloud of old energy being cleared away being returned to source for cleansing and transmutation, leaving you free and clear with your beautiful third eye chakra spinning gently, radiant, glowing, clear, brilliant indigo, allowing this light to fill your head. having a sense of that light washing through the whole of your body. And with your next in breath, allowing your awareness to move to the top of your head, to the crown chakra, that brilliant violet sphere of light resting at the crown of your head, allowing your breath to connect with this violet orb of light, and just noticing any shadows Any, any dents or indentations, anything that's marring the perfect surface of this beautiful violet orb, allowing your breath to connect deeply with the center of this orb, imagine, sense, see or feel this orb of light gently spin and as it spins shrugging off any of the darkness, any of the shadows or dirt and seeing this old energy picked up, returned to source for cleansing and transmutation, seeing with your mind's eye the orb of violet light in a perfect sphere, free of any dents or indentations, clear, brilliant, violet light, feeling, sensing or imagining this violet light washing through the whole of your body. Drawing a deep cleansing breath, just imagining each of these orbs of light clear and bright, sensing where they are located in your body, imagining them connected by a column of light running through the center of your body. You may sense, see, feel or imagine these 
as a series of colored beads on a string. And have a sense of this string being gently pulled from above and below so that it pulls taut in a straight line pulling each of these coloured beads the brilliant orbs of your chakras into perfect alignment so that you feel aligned light strong, unshakable. You have a sense of clarity and purpose. And taking a deep cleansing breath, just letting that imagery, that imagining fall to the back of your mind. Taking a few breaths to sit comfortably, quiet in your body. Feeling what it's like in your body with cleansed and balanced chakras. Noticing how centered how vibrant, how energized you feel. And just allowing yourself now to become aware of the space around you as you get ready to come back into your day. Hearing the sounds in the room and outside the room feeling how your body is supported. Gently wiggling your toes and your fingers, taking a deep cleansing breath, gently blinking your eyes open, coming right back into your day. <sighs> Just sighing that out. Thank goodness, I was a bit concerned that I might open my eyes and find another black screen. <laughs> it's one of the perils of meditating, I think, online in a, a live video is you shut your eyes and everything can go to, to hell as it did this morning and you don't even realise. I think I was very lucky that um, there was a big flash as the big blue screen of death came up on my laptop so it kind of... I thought, oh, I wonder what that was. So I opened my eyes and realized I'm not broadcasting. <laughs> so Natalie, thanks so much for joining me. I'm glad you were able to find me the second time round. I hope you enjoyed today's meditation and getting your chakras cleansed and balanced, having this perfect alignment of energies within your body will help you move through your day with clarity, alignment and purpose and just a sense of being energized. Hey, Natalie, that's my pleasure. Um, I've had these little encounters with technology previously, so I'm glad that we got, got there in the end, and thank you so much for joining me. If there's anyone that you know would benefit from today's meditation, please do feel free to share that, and I will be presenting the Weekly Bliss Bomb again this time next week. I'm Linda Emsley from Love Lali. I'm an embodiment coach and spiritual healer. And I hope that you've enjoyed today's weekly bliss bomb. Bye for now.